Kiwa, the destroyer Tilangi. Here we are in the second fight of the night. This is a big fight. Kiwa Tilangi, he's had a tremendous amount of experience. He's also the current New Zealand cage fighting champion. He's tall at six foot four. He's the WKA amateur South Island heavyweight champion, UTC super heavyweight, ISKA intercontinental super heavyweight, ISKA pro commonwealth super heavyweight champion. He's here to fight. Hiro Tirangi at 28 years of age, six foot four, and he's ready to fight 15 KOs but he's had 39 fights. Can you believe it? 39 fights. to the red corner. His opponent, hailing from Auckland, Jason Psycho Sabi. Sonny, the interesting thing about this is Jason is 5 foot 11. He weighed in at 98.2 kilos yesterday. He was previously 97. But consider that this guy is the world middleweight, super middleweight champion. He's put on 20 odd Ks in the last 12 months. Yes, and the question remains see whether or not Jason Study is able to handle carrying the extra Ks against these big bed men and whether he retains the power he had at super middle and light heavy right up into the super heavyweight ranks. He weighs in this evening at 115 kilograms. He stands six feet four inches tall with a fight record of 31 victories, eight defeats, with 15 big wins by way of KO, the New Zealand cage fighting champion and the UTC super heavyweight champion of the world, Hiriwa. The Destroyer Tilangi! Consider also that both these fighters have got world titles for and Africa. He both Auckland, of them are very, very strong fighters. Both of these two fighters have a lot of heart. 
Now we're going to see. Jason Sutty is a very popular choice tonight for the crowd. They've seen him. They were here when he won his first world title. This is really a test for Jason Sutty. How he performs in this fight will determine his chances in the entire event. If he takes too much punishment to his legs, he's going to be in a lot of trouble later on in the second and third fights. is... He's got good hands, but he's also got long legs, and he'll throw those legs at your legs all day. Yeah, I've had the, have the privilege to actually fight Hedua myself, and he kicks very, very hard. My co-commentator today, Mike Angove, World Cruiserweight Champion. Both of these guys love to fight. Oh, just look at the intensity on these guys' faces. This is such a different event from last year, Neil. They are really psyched. They said this, this fight night is going to be bigger than last year, and absolutely it is. The pizzazz, the spectacular show that they put on earlier, is a lot, lot stronger than last Round year. Round one. And here we go. Talking to Jason two weeks ago, he said he doesn't even get nervous before fights now. He's fought a lot. He's very strong. He's probably got the hand speed over a lot of these fighters because he was a middleweight. Absolutely. He, he has retained the speed that he had as a middleweight. The question remains whether or not he can actually develop some power. Hirua going low with the leg kick there. Jason's a seasoned fighter. Hirua coming up. It's not even not, it's not a knockdown. It's a, it's a push. Just catching him off balance there. Just goes to show. Hirua looking very sharp though. You can see I think both these fighters have had more fights than anybody else. Oh my goodness. Jason Sutties. My goodness. My goodness. He went into backwards. a spinning backflip. Oh my goodness. This is an upset. This is Jason a huge was here upset. to fight. Jason was here to fight. Hedua Tirangi has knocked Jason Psycho Sutty out. I think it was a spinning back first. Spinning back first, catching Jason. Jason just will as be so came upset. In. You can't help but feel for Jason at this time because he's a middleweight going into the heavyweight ranks. He has fought a couple of the heavyweights before, but nothing like Hedua Tirangi. Hedua Tirangi is in better shape than I've ever seen him. This man is psyched. Jason Suddy, let me just say that Jason Suddy is one of the purest fighting warriors in New Zealand today. He will come back from today. I don't think you can find anyone with more heart than Jason Suddy, and that's speaking because the guy loves to fight. He loves to get into the ring. He enjoys what he does, and that was, that was a great hit. Jason will be seriously disappointed. That's his first real sojourn into the heavyweight division. That's the first time Jason has lost in the past three years, Neil. Here we go, he Jason turns and a spinning back fist and catches Jason right on the side of the right side of his jaw and he's gone down. Uh, and you can see he's he not going to get up He truly is a warrior. You here. know that if this guy could have got up, he would have. Uh, Unfortunately, he walked into that spinning back fist and that's what happened. That's what happens, in, particularly in the K1, but in kickboxing in general, there's 